Gates back and away they go. They are racing very, very slowly. Where was La Biche from stall two? She surely lost all chance from there as they make their way through the early stages. Mesa Mia, the international market's favourite, has got a really good start and leads up to, in second position, uh, Leon Tagrida, who's pretty prominent as well, yellow and green colours. Boslar is also up for the pace. And right round the outside, Ita Madia is also coming into a prominent posse. So that's your leading quartet at the moment. Back markers include Takmin, also the the back of the field, Bukra, but they're strung out all over Arabia here as they begin to make this long sweeping turn and head on down towards the final two and a half furlongs. And it's Mesamir that's out in front just, but now looming large on the outside is Eta Madia. These two have just gone on a little bit now to in third position, making a bit of headway is Durat Al Samlea. They're then followed by Bosla. The rest have all got lots of work to do. They've swung for home. They're well inside the final 350 now. And this Mesamir, the international market's favourite, grabbed the initiative early and is stretching on. Mesa Amir in the hands of Mohammed Al Hubail is well, well clear. Five, six lengths the advantage and racing up towards the line. Mesa Mir, as easy as you like for favourite backers in the opener. Mesa Mir was the best of these on official ratings and has blown them away. Mesa Mir, the winner. It's going to be tight for second in the end. It is close. I think six has just got that, though. Eita Madia also finishing strongly was Durat Al Samlea and also in the mix was Tan Seer. No doubt about the winner, though. Horse number 20, Mesa Mia, one of the 